the real time real estate segment today being brought to you by rsrmoney.com rsrmoney.com find out what your house is really worth not what it says on zillow although we'll give you zillow's number also because we like to tell you with the wrong number there's three others on there that are probably more accurate than zillow you can tell they're not a sponsor right uh, but uh, let's take a look and see what's going on today why today's housing supply is a sweet spots for sellers wondering if it still makes sense to sell your house right now the short answer is yes. And if you look at the current number of homes for sale, you'll see two reasons why. An article from Calculated Risk shows there are 15.6% more homes for sale now compared to the same week last year. That tells us inventory has grown. But going back to 2019, the last normal year in the housing market, there are nearly 40% fewer homes for sale. I was just told yesterday in Orange County, California, where I'm broadcasting right now, 70% less than the normal market. Seven zero less. Inventory is still rising. If you're watching us on ronsingleradio.tv or any of our socials, ABC News and Talk AM 1490 video feed, you're seeing a chart that shows inventory is rising, but it's still low. If you want to know what it's doing in your neighborhood, just go and register. RSR listana.com rsr listana.com yes i know when you go there it's going to give you anaheim but you can put your zip code in there and replace anaheim for your zip code and get the information on your zip code specifically and see what all the data shows here's a breakdown of how this benefits you when you sell number one you have more options for your move are you thinking about selling because your current house is too big too small or because your needs have changed if so the year-over-year -year growth gives you more options for your home search. That means it may be less of a challenge to find what you're looking for. So if you were holding off on selling because you were worried you weren't going to find your home like the, the home you like, this may be just the good news you needed. Partnering with a local real estate professional can help you make sure you're up to date on the homes available in your area. And I'd just to throw it out there, our friends at Geneva Financial, they have a transition loan. They'll use the equity in your existing home to buy the new home before you sell the existing home just because we know there are some people out there that would rather live indoors instead of that Coleman tent. Number two, you still won't have much competition when you sell. But to put it into perspective, even though there are more homes for sale now, there still aren't as many as there'd be in a normal year. Remember, the data from Calculated Risk shows we're down nearly 40% compared to 2019, and that large a deficit won't be solved overnight. As a recent article from Realtor.com explains, quote, the number of homes for sale and new listing activity continues to improve compared to last year. However, the inventory of homes for sale still has a long journey back to pre-pandemic levels, unquote. For you, that means if you work with an agent to price your house right, it should still get a lot of attention from eager buyers and could sell fast. Make sure you go and look at our, our sales max uh, video that we did for you rsrsalesmax.com rsrsalesmax.com bottom line if you're a homeowner looking to sell now's a good time you'll still have more options when buying your next home and there's still not a ton of competition from other sellers if you're ready to move let's connect to get the ball rolling that is the real-time real estate segment brought to you by rsrmoney.com rsrmoney.com